Weren't you? I'm still a. You see this helmet? Do you see this uniform? He's ready for AAR, guys. I mean, I don't you know what the fuck uniform? you guys are running. I mean, Yo, how are you guys hovering around? No matter what your fucking uniform looks like. Hey, hey guys, you got us at Congregal, right? Because y'all are too pussy to try to shoot what? us down. You were coming up and we were going down. Oh shit, we tried to shoot you down. You're just, just fucking mad at one, bro. What are you talking about, lazy? just mad at shit on you. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, We're ready, bro. You just can't hit your shots. Damn. Don't be salty. Don't be salty. Everybody be quiet. Everybody be quiet. I'm not salty. What's up, guys? 1v1, bro. Shut up. Good op, guys. That was amazing. Very well played by op 4. Uh, very, uh, I love how the pilots were always active doing reconnaissance, uh, dropping the guys off, so all around, uh, that was pretty good. Um, that was exciting to watch at the end, uh, when you guys kind of accidentally bumped into each other, so that was interesting. Yeah, um, yeah. So, I, that gave me an adrenaline rush, bro. I was over here jumping up and down. I was like, oh, it's about to go down. It's about to go down. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. I almost didn't even fucking see him on the road, honestly. I just happened yeah. to look Why over and I'm like, oh, shit, road? contact lift. So, Dude, I don't know. So, yeah, Why the um, fuck was y'all walking on the road? Because we had no way else to get back to our He's not, talk, B, he's not bro. talking about us. He's talking about them. Not y'all. I could give less of what y'all. Why the fuck was y'all walking on the road? Bro, they was off the road to the left. They had a high we, we were going, we were going downhill. They still lost. We were going downhill, um, guiding ourselves I didn't lose through shit. on the road. fell off a mountain. That was bullshit. Yeah, yeah I, don't, man, I, I, don't I don't know how y'all yeah, lost Oscar on high ground. I was going to probably do a re-entry, but Oscar died, so, um, yeah. But other than that, man, it was... That's retarded that that counted. Bro. Yeah, for sure. Y'all had high ground. Y'all should have definitely... What are you talking about? I was fucking with your clapping. MVG. I was clapping None you guys. What are you talking about? None of the four people on our team... You lost with no MVG. None of us had night vision. Clap shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yo, you, you tell me you I didn't, didn't watch. You didn't clap Well shit, done, bro. guys. Well I done. At least, I got at least two of you up on that hill. Don't fucking care. Alright, guys. Alright, guys. Uh, and I, and I got let's do it. Let's do it. There was two of you that went down. Um, yeah, we picked get, up the second one. Oh, you lucky ass bitch. Still got smoke. Get fucked. Listen up. So, so guys, I'm pissing a, about and listen to the man. Yeah, yeah, let's do an AAR, guys. So, um, just want to know your feedback on everything, uh, especially the ops. How did you guys enjoy it? What did you guys think? What was the experience like? Just, uh, you know, what could be better? You know, just give me, give me some input on how you guys felt about this. I'd like some more information. Honestly, to go fuck I think it was too easy for all four. Oh, was that right? honest? It was honestly it was a little too easy for us. Are oh, you feeling like it was too easy? <laughs> yeah, we engaged the enemy one time and zombie you killed them all. You and talking it was lucky. mad. You like, dressed in a drug rug and a fucked up NBC I gear. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear shit. I still smoke two of you guys. I'm a pilot. You can't hit your shots on an aircraft worth a damn. Yeah, I still down one of you. I watched you go down. You know how hard it is to blow up a fucking heli? Watch that shit. It's not hard. I've shot down heli. It's not that difficult anymore. Talk about I wasn't hit shots. At the beginning of the game. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to. Everything you say is irrelevant. We didn't get told where the hell y'all were. We don't know where your base was. Well, well then that's your, that's your heli's problem because heli is on our. Well, uh, I would like to add because something, guys. Uh, if, base if from possible. OBJ one and heli found us and followed us and circled us all the way to our field of base. And yeah, we didn't know that was um yeah. that was you boys. Yeah, Honestly, we thought that, that was, was the OBJ. Lazy said, "Karkada." I mean, we were shooting at Lazy. We shot at Lazy with an armored uh. Uh, armored Toyota, and then we shot at him shot from the ground the too, and in. Yeah, but I, I said that. I was calling out your guy. I knew where you guys were. Like I was sitting there on the map, wa <laughs> like fair, I was watching the helicopter fly around, and I was listening for shots. And I was telling my team where you guys were, but nobody wanted to head north. It sounds like it sounds like a miscommunication slash. Uh, Team error on your part. Absolutely, That's Oscar. If you've got something to tell us, 
tell us and we'll I'm tell your team. We went on about it for 10 fucking minutes. I just We up. told you if you wanted to reach us, get on 40 megahertz. Get on channel 40, 40 to reach us. I well, I, I would like to, to say, guys. Nobody replied to me. Um, I, said for, it. I said it multiple times. On our end, uh, on our end, I'd really like the up. Um, our to team moved. Fair, did take the informant out. You should have let. Jordan, stop talking. Didn't need informant. Jordan, informant was talking. a liability Jordan, to us. Jordan, stop talking. Someone's talking. So, um, on our end, our team moved really um, very, very well. Um, our pilots uh, did uh, great work. Uh, they did some recon on the area and uh, were able to let us know uh, where to move. And nonetheless, we needed to check uh, different compounds looking for. Um, this uh, high value target um, on the other hand one moment Lacey was taking fire um, from the north that would be the the city you guys are talking about right now so we were able to identify where the shots were coming from uh, by that moment we already passed uh, that spot on the map so we head back to base to reassess um, once again we uh, went into the helis went to Congregal outpost and it's where uh, we found the guys. Uh, I got down with uh, by one of them, and yeah, at that moment I went back to base, and um, we came to AAR. But at the end of the day, it was really cool, the op uh, dynamic, and I, I really liked it. It was fun. I liked working with another pilot in the air. It was fun. I liked something with the guns. Yeah, you know, like once we get rockets, the rocket space game, you guys shouldn't be fucking laughing anymore, we'll be fucking you guys up. Not even rockets, man. Just the fucking MGs on the UH-60 instead of the miniguns. Because the miniguns can't be reloaded. Oh, yeah. When they bring in them rockets, bro, they're gonna bring in the fucking actual damage to your rudders and shit. So it's gonna Where be easier to take you down. Those oh, things already thing take a substantial amount of damage. Easy. You still can't shoot me down with Oh, so one more thing, one more thing. <laughs> Uh, I'm so sorry I team kill Oscar. At one moment I lost track of him. I lost track of him so I didn't know where he was. And all of a sudden he was 12 o'clock, maybe 1 o'clock. And I was like, who is this guy? And I took him out and it was Oscar. So my bad, I'm so sorry. I think he was. Yeah, bro was like, yeah, you gotta go take the hill and then shoots me in the fucking face. <laughs> I'm so sorry, bro. <laughs> Yeah, ground team needs to get better at communication among the yeah. squad. Other than that, yep, yep. You know, so he was good. Pay attention to their yeah, uniforms. Yeah, will get better at that. Like, he'll be better. Like, especially when I come in, like, for that briefing there. That was kind of shit. That's my bad. Yeah, this will get that in. Two point body up. I thought it was cool for all four. Uh, yeah. Some uh, some more uh, telebands, you know what I mean? As a little, as a little like little idea like that. I thought that was pretty cool, you know what I mean? And shit, some tally on tally action, you know? <laughs> yep, yep. I enjoyed the fact that we actually had to find the targets. I yep, did like yep. that. But we actually had to like figure it out. Next time we just need to coordinate a little bit better. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Hey, yo, next time, bro, we're going to try to get some more out four up in here. Next time, we'll out four. Next time, can we actually know where the fuck they are? They know where our base is. We don't know where their base is. How does that balance? Very good, guys. Well done. Where did your base was? I wasn't you guys. You're going to add something, Ripper? No, it's not. It was FOB blessing for them. They weren't supposed to come at you guys. We were just here swapping they helicopters and somebody... They should have been that blessing, but the whole op, that's, that's what I do. I give free reign. So, technically, they should have been that blessing, but they decided to come here, okay? So, that's free reign. I'm not going to tell them, well, hey, don't come here. But I already gave you guys the briefing. You guys seen where I had you at, blessing. So, they didn't know. But you guys were putting out information on the chat thing, uh, especially New Tech. You put out the... The blessing thing when we was about to probably re-engage, but that pretty much threw, threw a wrench in it. So, yeah, you guys got to be careful with that. Well, the, the information... Now, technically, y'all should have been operating out of blessing, but... Yeah, yeah. With the, with, the, uh, with the ops, I let guys have free reign. 
I agree. I agree. I don't. I don't hold hands when we do ops, bro. You you get that from other uh, operations or other militants where they kind of have it broken down like step by step. I don't do that. I kind of let you guys. You know, I like the improv. Yeah, I yeah. agree. The improv was good. Improv makes it real life. We don't know what the fuck they're doing. We don't know where the fuck they are. They yeah. don't know what the fuck they're doing. They may know where the fuck we are, right? We're in a set fucking military base. Yeah. They're yep. in the fucking mountains. And we've got. Exactly. And the thing is, is like we don't necessarily need like. There's so many. Uh, uh, like we could move. We could use a temporary FOB. It's nice. Yep. There's, there's, there's so, so many, many different, different outposts and shit like that. Yeah. That we have exactly. access to. They. I'm not going to use those anymore. Well, I landed there, and then suddenly the entire fucking ground team is dead. The pilot's got to get out the goddamn UH-60 to come support, and then Oscar's dead. <laughs> yeah. And then I'm just nah. sitting on a fucking mountain I by fell myself off, I in fell the off dark. The thing due to fucking negligence. That was bullshit. Yeah, I if, thought, he, oh, if yeah, he wouldn't no. have fell off, I would have, uh, I would have asked you guys if you wanted to reinsert, and we could have. Because uh, Taliban had at least one more objective to do. But uh, since he fell, I was like, well, that's pretty much it. Very good, very good. Damn. Final fuel. Yeah, I, and I jumped onto Gravity. a spot where I couldn't get back up, so it wasn't, there wasn't, it was a fucking a rip. Yeah, damn. Yeah, that, that was fun. Because I saw where you guys pushed back to, so what I was going to do is I was going to get on top of you, but then I got stuck on the fucking rock. So that was uh, not yeah. happening, Captain. We had Reaper get stuck in the UH-60 after we landed here. <laughs> he had to respawn. That was so funny. <laughs> 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 oh yeah. Um, so you guys, uh, and another thing with the free range. So they decided not to utilize the informant. So that was uh, that was part of the thing as well. You guys could have actually gotten their location. If you would have went to the informant, and pretty much where the hell was the informant? He was uh, in Nagalong. I was coming. I was coming to tell you guys, but uh, you basically already had your plan figured out. Obviously, nobody listened to me. I guess, or probably ignored the fact that they did have that option. The only option, I mean, you know, the option you guys took was pretty much the, you know, kind of use the reconnaissance role, which wasn't wrong. It's just, you know, like I said, I give you multitude of things to utilize. It's just whatever you decide. Next time, for the love of God, if you've got information you want to give us, give us the information. Don't assume we're not going to use it. Yeah, all, uni all information could be fucking medical, mission critical information. Say so we're not just gonna hear you go. You have a guy who can tell you where they are, and we're not just gonna ignore that. We're gonna use it. Were you in the briefing? <clears throat> yes, I was in the briefing. You said like the informant existed. You didn't say where he was. I didn't right. realize we actually had to go. I thought the inf see that was another thing that I was. I thought the talent man guy we were going to that last base was the informant. I thought that was the whole point we were going there. And I then you, that nobody. Yeah, and then nobody it turns was out playing. This is their fucking base. Yeah, I thought that was yeah. I thought that was the where the informant was gonna. We were supposed to capture his ass. I was getting ready to torture him. I tased him. I tased him. Man. No, dude. I was gonna. I, here's the thing. When you knife somebody, they go down. You can patch them up. And I was just gonna be like, listen, dog. Like we ain't playing around. And he would have said something. I just would have knifed him, patched him up, and then kept started tasing him until he told me what I wanted to know. Other than the war crimes, who the hell was the bloody dude y'all walked out of the shack with? I just see y'all walk out of a shack with a man without a shirt, bloodied with a He wasn't around uh, there. He wasn't going? around there. A bear naked. I don't know who was he. Yeah, he was just rolling around. It's a shirtless Taliban dude just walking around. <laughs> yeah. And he was with we y'all, so I assumed like that was HVT, so I was sitting there, I was like, okay, get the HVT and the fucking little bird so we can get out of here. I put some civilian down, bro, bro running up on us with a bomb vest, then going to tell everybody that we're here. Hell nah, doggy. All I heard was, we don't have to take him with us, and then you unload two rounds of what I assume is 9 <laughs> mil into somebody. Like, yeah, yeah, no, because I, I had him, he was like trying to run away, and then fucking... Bro, I had him like stuck up against the tree so he couldn't run away and then they're like, oh, we don't need his ass And I was just like you ain't telling your boys bop, bop. Oh, yeah, we, we tried to tase him but he escaped I'm like that fucking I'm on that CIA shit. He wasn't there
that know gotta kill everybody that knows. I like some straight say, Amanda, some I straight Amanda Waller shit. The fuck on our end, I, that was really fun. Yeah, that was fun. I enjoyed doing that recon and shit like that. It so tomorrow, fun. hey yo, is everybody is everybody here showing up? Hey yo, hold up, hold up. Yeah, hey, go. Do you there? Yeah, I'm here. Does everybody know about the thing tomorrow? Yeah. Yeah, everybody knows. Okay, let it. Uh, are you guys all showing up? Yes, sir. Obviously. Okay, so I have no idea. Uh,